morning guys. Um, right, I'm sat on the floor today because I'm going to attempt to smoothly unbox Watch Dogs Dead Sec Edition on the PlayStation 4. Jess got me this yesterday, it was immensely cheap. I think it retailed at about £90 and she managed to pick this up for 40 It's brand new, it's still in the cellophane, hence my trusty pen, my implement to open. Now before we do that, this is my copy of Watch Dogs and I'm going to give you guys an opportunity to win this. I'll tell you how at the end of the video. So if you want to win this exact copy, um, then, you know, it's be dead straightforward to kind of enter a little competition. Uh, it's play, um, PS4 obviously, um, region free, PlayStation 4 games are, so whatever country you're in, more than happy to post it to you. But for now... Let's start this unboxing. So there may be little bits where I've kind of chopped things out to edit. Um, so let's just go ahead and rip off the cellophane. Uh, just to kind of prove that this is brand new. I wanted to kind of keep the cellophane on. Um, because sometimes I know people, you know, say it's brand new, but they've had it weeks and they've played it and opened it, etc. Okay, so there we go. So the box is quite heavy, guys. Um, there we go, a little close up. I don't know what that ridge is down the side, but it looks like this is in a slip case because there's some tape at the top, which I'm gonna remove. Uh, preferably without damaging the box. See if we can get that off there without damaging it. Yeah. Now, obviously, if you guys wanna fast forward, I don't mind. Sometimes, you know, it can be a little bit monotonous watching, you know, these unboxings get a little bit, ah, destroy the box, I'm a little bit nervous about doing them. So there's the slip case guys. Oh, wait a sec, more tape on the bottom as well. Um, there we go. Wow, okay, so, just move that out. More tape, so, this is the outer shell, slip case, whatever you want to call it, so we'll go ahead and chuck that down there. So, here's the box itself then guys, so, Looks like there's a seam. This seam here is the hinge for the side. So, wow, okay. Let's try and open it without everything falling out, which so far, so good. Maybe not. Okay, let's do it like this. And then I'll bring it all forward to show you guys. So, opens quite nicely there, guys. As you can see, you've got everything in there. Presume that this is the figure. But let's go ahead and show you what we have. So, this is the steel book. Um, which the game obviously we can kind of pop that in afterwards because the game is right underneath and that is here. So that will go nicely in there. What else do we have here? Um, I don't know what's in here. It did say on the back of the slip case exactly what you uh, what was you know included. So um, it says download the app. So there's an app to download. Available App Store and Android Market. Use collector function. Aim at e okay. So they're augmented reality cards, guys. So you can see they're quite nicely packed in there. Uh, let's go ahead and pull these out. Um, and each, so it's almost like a concertina arrangement of cards. So we can pull them out and there's each card. I don't know what's on these. If you guys got the Dead Sack Edition, actually, please comment. I always encourage people to comment on these videos because I want it to be interactive. I don't just want to sit here and chat away. So if you have used these augmented reality cards, do let me know. The, the box that they come in, it's quite neat, it's quite compact. I love that, I love the packaging um, on these limited editions. I think it's quite important to get the detail right. Um, okay, what have we got next then? This is a map of Chicago, as it says there. So on camera, let's open it up. Feels quite nice. It's not a cloth map like some of the Skyrim um, maps were, but nonetheless, Map finish, um, map, brilliant, that's really really nice and on the back there, just some detail on the back but there's the map itself so I'll pop that down there. Next we have the soundtrack, the Watch Dogs official soundtrack and on the back there are 13 tracks so um, you know I'm not... <laughs> When I've played this game, I haven't really noticed the, the music as much, but I guess it's kind of, you know, getting things like this allows you to pay attention to detail that you might not pick up on in the game, so definitely worth kind of popping that in uh, with my MacBook. And then some badges as well, so they're quite nice there, guys. 
you can see them right there. So that's kind of how the box is with all the gubbins out. Now let's go ahead and remove this. Um, oh, wait a sec. We'll do this first, we'll do this first. This is the hardback art book, one believes. Um, yeah, this is nice, this is really, really nice. Um, so as you can see, the book starts with the characters. You can see them there. And then progressing along, obviously naturally we start with Aidan Pierce with various stances. We've got the 360 kind of panoramic of the uh, character on the bottom, various um, weapon stances there. Jackson Pierce, Nicky Pierce. Really, really nice. I love, 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 love these art books. And it's quite a nice size as well. I've had special editions in the past where the art books are really, really small and you try to turn the page and the book kind of cracks because it doesn't want to be opened almost. But this is quite easy to manoeuvre, you know. Brandon Docks. Really, really good attention to detail. And again, I think these special editions are really worth it just to kind of scope in on the attention to detail. You know, things that you might miss within a game. Um, so let's move this down now. Now this, I don't know if you can see this guys, but encrusted on the front it does say Watchdogs and Ubisoft branded on the back. Um, and obviously we need to just remove this um, sticker there. Must be some small pieces in it. There he is. And as usual, it's really hard to get the figures out of the box. Okay, wow, that, wow, that is great. That is great. I'll put some pictures on, guys, so you can see this in more detail. Um, but the detail on that is, is pretty nice, actually. Um, as you can see, he's got his cell phone in his hand uh, with his with his handgun in the other. And, it you know, it's great. It's really, really nice. He's in the moment. And that will go nicely on my top shelf. So there we go, guys. This has been the Gebs24. Um, I'm nearly at 2,400 subscribers, which is great. Um, you know, and, and I'm doing all right on my Facebook group as well. Now, I said at the beginning, if you guys want an opportunity to win this, um, what I'm going to do, in the description, there's going to be a link to my blog, because I wrote a review on Watch Dogs as it you know, initially came out. If you want to be within, you know, a chance to win this, I want you to go to the link, go to the blog, and leave a comment on the blog. Second thing I want you to do is to go over to the Gebs24 Facebook page, link in the description, and after this video has gone live, there will be a picture of this on the Facebook page. Like the Facebook page and comment on the picture. That's all I want you to do. If you forget these instructions, they'll be repeated in the information box below. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to message me on Facebook, but I'm happy to post this anywhere in the world. Um, what I'll do is I'll draw a name at random at the hat and I will do that on my next pickups video. So you've got about seven days to go if you want to be in a ch within a chance to win this bad boy, my original copy of Watch Dogs. So that's it for now, guys. Thank you very much. Um, I've got something coming up called What's in the Box? Something from the lads over at Game Shed, so keep an eye out for that. But for now, take care and I'll see you soon.